Be Wealthy and Smart, episode 1224. into a world of wealth and financial freedom without budgets, boredom, or bosses on Be Wealthy and Smart. And now, here's your host, Linda P. Jones. Welcome to Be Wealthy and Smart. I'm Linda P. Jones, America's Wealth Mentor, empowering women and men worldwide to financial freedom. On today's show, I'm going to share an interesting article with you about two of the world's richest men and why they loaded up on the exact same stock. Can you guess what stock it is? Maybe you can. The stock I'm referencing is Tesla. Both Elon Musk and Larry Ellison are now among the top four richest people in the world, says the Bloomberg Billionaires Index. Musk is number one and Ellison is number four. And both can largely thank their Tesla stock for that. Musk is the largest owner of Tesla stock And Ellison, founder of Oracle, is the seventh largest Tesla owner, ahead of even mutual fund giant Fidelity. Anyone writing Tesla stock's powerful 120% gain this year is profiting handsomely. But these S&P 500 company founders are living testaments to the power of placing big bets on top performing stocks. To date, Tesla's stock has been valued as a disruptive technology player that is transforming electric vehicle adoption globally in this green tidal wave, said Wedbush's Dan Ives. However, Musk and company have built an EV castle with its supercharger network, battery technology, and software ecosystem that is unmatched globally compared to any other auto player, in our opinion. It's not surprising to see Musk such a large holder of Tesla stock, He's considered the person to make the company what it is now. What is noticeable, though, is the size of the position he's maintained over the 20 years since its founding. Musk still owns more than 411 million shares of Tesla. That amounts to nearly 13% of the company, more than anyone else, says an investor's business daily analysis of data from S&P Global Market Intelligence and MarketSmith. And that's paying off handsomely this year. The value of Musk's stake has risen $60.6 billion just this year. The massive size of Musk's remaining ownership stake is noteworthy, including in comparison to other high-tech founders who have lightened up. Microsoft co-founder Bill Gates, via the Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation, only owns 0.5% of that company now. And even Jeff Bezos' stake in Amazon has whittled down to just 9.7%, but he's still the number one holder of Amazon. And Alphabet, or Google founder Larry Page, is only number three largest shareholder with a 6.1% ownership of Google's parent stock. Larry Ellison, though, seems to understand not only the power of Tesla, but also concentrated positions. His 45 million shares of Tesla added $6.6 billion in wealth to his portfolio this year alone. Ellison's position is more than 700% larger than that of Kathy Wood's ARK Invest, although her name is more closely linked to Tesla than Ellison's is. And Tesla isn't even the very top reason Ellison is back in the top five richest people in the world. For that, he can thank holding on to a staggering 42% of Oracle, the tech company he founded nearly five decades ago. The value of his 1.15 billion Oracle shares has risen more than $46 billion this year. Shares of Oracle are up nearly 50% this year on the company's inroads in AI software and services. No investor comes anywhere near his ownership position in the company. Even ETF giant Vanguard only owns 5% of the company and is a distant second to Ellison. Diversification can certainly help cushion portfolios in tough markets, but as Musk and Ellison prove, when an S&P 500 stock is rocking, you want to own as much as possible. And the article goes on to show a chart of Tesla Titans, Elon Musk owning 12.9% of Tesla, Vanguard owns 6.9%, BlackRock owns 5.6%, State Street Global Advisors owns 3.1%, 
Capital Research and Management owns 1.6%. Geode Capital Management owns 1.5%. Larry Ellison owns 1.4%. FMR owns 0.9% of the shares of Tesla. Norges Bank Investment Management owns 0.8%. And Northern Trust Global Investments owns 0.8% of Tesla stock. Now, all of that happened while Tesla stock recently slumped 9.7% on fears of shrinking profit in July of 2023. But having a concentrated position isn't all that it sounds like it's cracked up to be. After hitting a split-adjusted high of $410 in November of 2021, Tesla shares sank as much as 75% to a two-year low of $102 in January of 2023 largely thanks to Musk-related distractions related to Twitter. But the stock has since rallied dramatically after a pair of strong quarterly earnings reports. Still, Musk offloaded more than $40 billion worth of Tesla stock between November of 2021 and December of 2022. A large chunk of the sales were to fund his $44 billion purchase of Twitter. So while Tesla stock is on a strong rebound and is doing well now, it's definitely not for the faint of heart. If you haven't yet subscribed to Be Wealthy and Smart, hit the subscribe button and you'll be notified as soon as new podcasts are available. And all of my podcasts are in my wealth mentoring library on my website at lindapjones.com forward slash podcasts. That's all for today. Until next time, live the good life and be wealthy and smart. Thank you for listening to Be Wealthy and Smart with Linda P. Jones. Share the wealth and tell your family and friends about the show. Check out our website, blog, and social media for more riches at www.bewealthyandsmart.com.